Hello everyone, this is D22 with you today, and I'm going to show you how to render to full 1080p resolution in Sony Vegas Pro 10. So we have our video here, and we just want to make sure that it's done. So this video is done. This is just a short video here. So how to render it, here is the setting. You have to make sure your project video properties are at 1080, 60i, 1440 by 1080, 29 frames. That's basically 30 frames per second. And the audio, you have to make sure that it's stereo. So that basically will give you the clearest audio and it won't have any sort of lags depending on your files. And you don't have to change any other of these settings except just to make sure that the template is 1080, 60i, 1440 by 1080, 29 frames. So then you click Save to save everything. And if you want to start all the new projects with these settings, you click on this box and then it will automatically revert to these settings so you don't have to worry about it. So what we'll do next is we'll go to File and then Render As and then we'll go to Custom. But it just depends on what you want to set it as. If you want to set it as WMV, MP4, MOV, it really doesn't matter as long as you're familiar with the format and it's not let you down. So we're going to click on Custom and we make sure that the audio is 256. It's like the highest Actually, the highest setting is 320 kbps, but I use 256 for my videos. So make sure that it's set to higher or better if you have a better computer. And then what you do is you go to video, and then the image size, the image size, sorry, can't talk today. The image size is 1440 by 1080. So you make sure that that resolution is that size so that it will come out to full 1080p. So that when you render it, it won't come out as 720. So after you've put those settings into your custom, you just click Save, and then OK, and then you click Save. And that's basically how you render in full 1080p on Sony Vegas. But another question that I wanted to answer to some of the subscribers is that if you click on the X here for your video preview, where did it go? You want to see what you've been doing all this time. Not to worry. What you do is you click on the View button here, and then you go click Video Preview. So that way, you'll get back what you've lost because that that happens it happens to the best editors accidentally removing something and you're not sure where it is but to when you go to view you can bring back to whatever you lost here so there's a lot of options that you can put in here I'm not going to go through them all at this time but for the video preview you make sure that you click video preview if this little thing here is gone so you click view and then video preview and then it's back so that is how you do it well, thanks so much for watching this tutorial. I hope it's helped. It's a little short, but this will just address to some of the people that have been having this video preview missing error. And I hope that helps. So get Field for Life. I'll see you later.